Dear friends of Ortelino, hello, my name is Dieter Manschura and I'm the owner and manager of Ortelino Company. Today I want to speak about Sosaku Hanga. Sosaku Hanga was a Japanese printmaking art movement. Well, it set in roughly 1910-1915 and lasted so roughly until 1960. Uh, Hanga in Japanese uh, means print and Susaka means creative, uh, so it's creative prints. Uh, Susaku Hanga was a complete breach with the old tradition of uh, Japanese printmaking, which is known um, under the word of ukiyo-e. Traditional Japanese printmaking was a teamwork of an artist, a carver, a printer and a publisher. Well, the artist usually made only the design and well, the rest was done by people who were considered uh, as artisans, not so much as artists. When Japan made huge strides towards the end of the 19th century um, to keep up with Western countries, well, they had called um, for foreigners to come to their country, engineers, um, scientists, but also artists. Yeah? There were many European um, art professors uh, teaching at Japanese universities. And at the same time, Japan had sent thousands of students uh, to Europe and to North America and also art students. Well, these art students, they studied in Paris, they studied in, in Rome or in Berlin, and they experienced the Western concept of art, or what they considered to be the Western concept of art, and they experienced uh, French Impressionism and then Post-Impressionism, and later uh, Fauvism, Henri um, Matisse, for instance, uh, or the German Expressionists. And when these young uh, Japanese art students came back to their homeland, okay, they came there uh, with the idea of, uh, uh, with a different concept of an artist, with the concept of an artist as a creative genius. And of course, a creative genius must create the art product from the beginning, from the design, and until the, the end. Or at least, um, the artist must be under control of the complete process. So they discarded the, the old concept of, of teamwork and they thought, hey, we have to carve our blocks ourselves and we have to print our, ourselves, otherwise we are no real artists. Well, but they had one problem. A Japanese carver needed roughly 10 years of apprenticeship to become a good carver. It was such a high level, it was so elaborate, that was not so easy. And the same for the printers. So when our Susaku Hanga artists started to create their first prints, um, they came out a little bit clumsy and they looked technically challenged. Okay, I don't mean this as an insult, but this is what Susaku Hanga is, what also the German, in, in the woodblock prints created by the German Impressionists um, or, okay, uh, here you have a few examples. Um, this is Unichi Hiratsuka in black and white, for instance, or two landscapes by Masao Maeda, or, well, the famous cats by Tomo Inagaki. Uh, looks very modern, very Western like. Okay, um, and this is. Actually, what collectors of Susaku Hanga appreciate so much of it, of it, because it has a certain charm. It's, it's different, it, it doesn't have the high skill of Shinhanga prints, but it's lovely, it's, it's, it's well, let's call it, 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 it cute. Susaku Hanga, compared to Shinhanga, has remained however, a small market niche. Uh, however, an exclusive and fine market niche Collectors pay uh, a lot of money uh, for, for such examples of Susaku Hanga prints. 
Okay, to conclude with, let me introduce to you a, a few uh, books. One, Modern Japanese Woodblock Prints by Helen Marriage. Well, this covers both Sosaku Hanga and Shin Hanga. And it's mostly text, but if you want to inform yourself about modern Japanese prints of the 20th century, uh, this book is a must and it's not expensive. Uh, the other one is by Oliver Stadler. Oliver Stadler had a pioneer role in promoting Japanese prints. He came to Japan as, as a GI and um, visited uh, the most important artists and made interviews with them and that is what you, what you find in, in there. Yeah? Interviews with all the major artists of the Susako Hanga movement. Okay, if you uh, would like to purchase one of these um, attractive Sasako Hanga prints, you have a chance with our online auctions every week, uh, each Wednesday at 8 p.m. our local time, which is Central European time, starts our um, Japanese prints online auctions, where we uh, offer you Japanese prints from all periods, including Sosako Hanga, and uh, I would be pleased to see you there. For today, thank you for watching, and goodbye, and have a nice weekend.